shooting hopes. She is accused of making up an elaborate story of being shot by an intruder. That launched a massive search for someone who didn't even exist. Eyewitness News reporter Stephen Schuler joins us live with details on why the wife of a police officer may have to foot the bill for the search efforts. Well, Jennifer Smith is out of the hospital, but not out of the woods. She's been summoned on multiple charges, and her detailed hoax could cost her financially. With canines and helicopters, state and local agencies searched far and wide in Somerset Friday night after a Midland Road resident told police she'd been shot in the arm by an armed suspect who is still on the loose. Then Saturday, authorities charged 33-year-old nurse Jennifer Smith with making the story up. This woman is going to be prosecuted because it's an embarrassment uh, for the department to be wasting all of its resources and time and efforts. Eyewitness News legal analyst Lou Polner says the massive resources spent on the unnecessary search could mean Smith, the wife of a Fall River detective, will have to pay up. I'm certain that the town, as part of its plea disposition with this particular woman, uh, can arrange for costs to be paid. Forty to fifty officers spent a combined 500 man hours searching for the fake suspect. Smith is charged with filing a false police report and giving false information. And Polner is surprised no additional charges were filed. I would think there should be some weapons violation charges in there. I mean, shooting a, a gun in a compact area is most certainly a crime uh, in all jurisdictions. Now, we did try to contact Somerset Police to see whether Smith will face more charges, but no one returned our calls. The Bristol County District Attorney's Office tells us a decision on restitution wouldn't happen until a conviction is handed down. I'm Stephen Schuler, Eyewitness News.